Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, I hope all of you are having a great day. So have a plan with me in my new planner. This will be my first time using this planner. Um, it's a new planner, but it's not a new layout for the monthlies. So this is the penny pages. We'll do in the month of February. Oh, February. January, not February. So what uh, this is a five wide planner and one thing that i realized is erin conja and the kids fit perfectly a little bit maybe um moving it and stuff but they kind of fit like 99 percent. they fit 99 percent in the monthly planner and um, so I decided to pick one up from from uh, uh, Jump to Design. She had this beautiful one. I was like, why not? It's beautiful. It's pretty. Why not try it out? So this comes as a three uh, three page sheet. Um, you could do foil. I decided not to do foil because I kind of like the design of it. So let's get started. Um, this planner is brand new. The monthly is not brand new because I did use the um, uh, the daily. It's I think it's like be productive daily, which I will be using until the planner ends, which is in February. So I'm excited to finish it up. It's kind of fun, especially with the daily. But one thing I realized about that planner is um, there's not enough time to film post like do a little bit edits and um use it really functional so what i have been doing it just using it as a regular to-do planner just write down with the pen and i have been loving it i didn't film i would decorate some some of them when i have like space left i would just use washi to cover it up so um, with this, you get this big sheet. Of course, it's made for your conjunct. And also, there's also extra sh uh, uh, extra sh uh, strip because one thing I found out is the Erin Conjunct did a different planner. I'm not sure what Erin Conjunct is, uh, what's their um, whole thing. But when you look at it, it kind of fits. It will overhang a little bit on the side like overlap but um, it does well, it will not bother me but i'm thinking about just covering this thing you might you might see it or might not so the monthly i will be using so this planner what i have been i want to use is for my university it's really fun one so i'm kind of excited to use it so let's see There you go. Uh, it kind of overlaps over here, so I would have to like figure out something, maybe move the sticker more. But overall, I like it. It's really nice. It's pretty. It fits. <laughs> so Erin Crunching Kids fit. But also you have to look, it depends on the shop. So, uh, because different shops have different ways, different Erin Crunching Planner that they purchased. So also, always look through their description see what they have what they don't have um because you never know i could say one thing uh, but it could turn out totally different so for a5 wide for penny pages erin conjun kids fit almost perfectly <laughs> for me it doesn't bother that it just has a little um on the side doesn't bother me but really excited about this planner i did this see this planner when it came out and i was kind of excited about it but i didn't purchase because i was kind of um, halfway through the year and i didn't want to buy a planner which is like 
I like starting from January till December. That's how I am. I know some people that it doesn't bother them, but for me, it does kind of bother. So, okay, let's see. Okay. So this one does overlap a little bit, so I might just cut off a little piece because it doesn't really, I might have just, but I think so will be fine. It's not like it's that big of a deal. It's not like breakable point. Well, let's put this one. Let's see how long it is. Oh, it's almost as long as this nice i like it. i like when the ships just go all the way i'm learning i'm learning some stuff so it is bigger than this box as you would see over here but um, that doesn't bother me it's perfectly fine it's planner you could cut piece off if you want it there's a bunch of tools and everything I like it. I like this that I have some. I love using this. This is really functional for me. Like some tasks and stuff. I don't really show what I write over here. Because th there's like phone numbers and information. Like really kind of personal. So so let's see. The date that's. Uh, Saturday. Saturday's the first. Um, I think I'm gonna put over here. I kind of like the uh, to put put the date that's over here, and I kind of hate that uh, the um, happy planner has over here. The new planner that I got, I kind of just don't like it. So there is this. Um, so I like it. when you look at it jump to design has all the information if you want to which is which so let's put this uh, before I kind of want to write out this line you might show show up my not but nice so five Done with ding dots. The planner looks really nice, festive. So let's get the New Year's. It's going to be fun. New Year's Day, then um, what the Lunar King Day. It's going to be the 17th.
but hey. And then there's like also extra ones. So this is really nice. I like the extras. So one thing that I'll be using this planner for is for my university. Like it's going to be like monthly over overview of what I need to do. So first day of university is the 24th. So let's put a cute box. Not really a box, but something... Let me just look in. So, for example, also the shop has different uh, days. For example, if you want to start it from uh, uh, maybe Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, so you could just put it there. That's kind of nice. Um, I don't know if I want to use something, but let's mark uh, like celebration. My friends wedding anniversary is gonna be so i have to like i want to put it over here I'm like i have a like reminder it's kind of nice so it's kind of sad that my uh, grandfather died last year in february and it would have been his birthday the 23rd but he's no longer here with us it's really s sad and um it's it's sad there's like no other words but he was getting older and um it's kind of um i don't know why but i just went really kind of in a dark uh, place but um he's in a better place that's what i wanted to say so let's continue with more like school and stuff so i'm thinking about using these beautiful strips over here they're so cute why not is it like a mini divider oh that's perfectly for the first day of universe never mind not the 24th yeah the 24th why I'm just why i'm just like i don't know all over the place <laughs> um so there are I don't know a lot of what I would have to do. So I think so I will just leave this planner the way it is. And then uh, closer to the end or when the days are in, I'll be just um, writing more and putting more stickers. There's some uh, stickers left. Uh, I feel like there's not enough boxes for my opinion. So I might even pull out some other stickers. The fun thing about having a lot of stickers is you have a lot of options so this is everything from the kit um so i will link the both of the shops down below the planner the penny pages and jump to design love her stickers use those stickers in a lot of kits and you would even see my classic happy planner month lists also so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this uh, plan with me um thank you bye bye